So you're being your own internal salesperson. You're understanding the audience. We're all here. We want to increase sales. If you let me do this, here's how I'm going to help you accomplish that. So you've got the perspective, you've got the larger perspective, but even board level perspective in terms of what we're supposed to be doing. But what I also love is that you have the perspective as an agent, that you were there at the agent, as an agent in gold that the agents represent. And there's big studies out there that just even contact center leaders need to have more trust in their agents, let alone the rest of the company. So I think that your background is, it's made you uniquely suited to understand the value that can be mined, the value that can be provided. And when you did some of that self-service, what did that do for the volume of tickets that were coming in? Just in one month, we could see a decrease in 10% with like, where is my order? And that is something we see decreasing every month now because we have worked with that so much. And what we also have worked with a lot is our like, FAQ. That's when I started, it wasn't that developed. And I see that as a talk, we want customers to, as much as possible, self-serve themselves with typical customer service questions. For example, where's my order or how do I make a return or what it can be so that the agents can be there to actually give advice, increasing the sales and getting like helping the customers to find the right products because that will make them the most happy. So we decided, I said like customer service have the best knowledge about what type of questions the customer asking, what they need help with. So I want my team to be the owner of the FAQ. It shouldn't be e-commerce, it should be customer service. So that is something we did. We took the ownership. We are the ones putting in all the articles, rewriting them, changing the information when we need, and really building this up. And we have really seen a decrease in this type of ticket since we started to build this one up. And because we are talking in the way that how the customer wants that we should talk to them. We are writing in the way that they understand, making it super clear for them. We have also worked with the SEO teams to also use words that we know is good to have when customers are searching to find the right articles and so on. So we have done a collaboration, but it is the customer service team that owns the FAQ. And we have built that up and done an amazing job. My team had done a really good job with this one. And we can really see that we are now able to be more on the chat, for example, helping out with product questions and so on, due to that we are the decrease in ticket. 